As we continue to explore the vast and unknown expanses of space, we are constantly making new and exciting discoveries. Space is a beautiful and mysterious place. In recent years, we have discovered so much about it, thanks to technological advances that have given us new ways to explore the unknown. Scientists and even non-scientists have made several remarkable space finds, some in outer space and some here on Earth, raising exciting possibilities about the universe beyond our own planet. Who knows what else is waiting to be discovered? So today, here at Unexplained Mysteries, we'll be taking a look at three such discoveries. Mysterious Sphere can be seen casting a giant shadow on the surface of Mars. Despite decades of research and exploration, Mars remains an utter mystery. Scientists still have many questions about the history of Mars and the possible future of the planet. For example, while scientists have found evidence that Mars used to have oceans, the real answer remains a mystery. Scientists also wonder if humans could potentially live on Mars, but it will take a lot of research and exploration to get that answer. Every new finding on Mars seems to bring us closer to understanding the planet while at the same time giving us a new puzzle to solve. Recently, scientists received photographic evidence of a large object on Mars's surface. A channel called Mars Moon Space TV discovered what seemed to be a large object casting a shadow on the surface of Mars. They found this white spherical object by zooming in on images captured by the Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter, a spacecraft created to explore Mars. The MRO satellite circles the planet, captures images, and then maps and sends data back to Earth to be analyzed by scientists. The mysterious sphere seems to be sitting in an area that scientists say used to be underwater. While scientists believe this giant lake existed, it has been millions of years since the lake was an actual body of water. While this recent discovery is incredibly intriguing, it is far from the first discovery on Mars to pique the interest of scientists over the years. Many mysterious, unknown objects have been discovered on Mars, and this new sphere is just another addition to the long list of unsolved mysteries on Mars. Only time will tell what new secrets will be revealed in the coming years. We just have to keep on searching. Rock found in Egypt comes from supernova. While new satellites and technologies are constantly being launched into space every day, we sometimes get space discoveries right here on Earth. According to a recently published research paper in the journal Icarus, a mysterious stone discovered in the Egyptian desert was confirmed to come from a supernova explosion from outside our own solar system. The stone named Hypatia, after a female Egyptian astronomer, was found in the Great Sand Sea in the mid-1990s. The sample was thought to be far different from anything that scientists have discovered on our Earth or even in the Milky Way galaxy. The stone has been analysed by a group of chemists at the University of Johannesburg since 2013, and they have reached several hypotheses about its origins. They believe that a red giant star collapsed into a white dwarf star that then formed part of a binary system along with another star that it later consumed. That white dwarf star later exploded as a supernova, with gas atoms from the explosion getting caught in a dust cloud that the team believes formed the stone's body as that dust cloud formed solid rock. According to the researchers, this formation occurred more than 4 billion years ago, with the rock later hurtling towards Earth and eventually landing in the Egyptian desert. If the team's hypothesis is correct, Hypatia would be the first tangible evidence on Earth of a supernova-type IA explosion, according to Jan Kramers from the University of Johannesburg. Equally exciting is that Hypatia may also provide evidence that a parcel of dust from outer space could actually be incorporated in the solar nebula that our solar system was formed from without being fully mixed in. There has been an exhaustive search for a definitive answer as to what this alien rock truly is. From analysing Hypatia, it was clear the stone could not have come from Earth, let alone our solar system. 
The rock only contained 1% of the silicon, manganese and chromium that it would have had if it had been born in our solar system. The stone also has exceedingly large amounts of other elements like iron, sulfur, copper and phosphorus. Space dust, asteroids and meteors in the Milky Way galaxy also do not seem to match the makeup of the stone. While there is evidence that Hepatia did not come from a red supergiant star, a familiar object in our universe, or a supernova type II, it does seem to match something far rarer. According to the researchers, Hepatia seems to fit something that would have come from a supernova type IA, which only occurs one or two times per century in each galaxy. It seems scientists have discovered something truly remarkable. Verona Rupes, the tallest cliff in the solar system. While there are constant new space discoveries, there are also space objects that scientists have known about for decades. That is the case with Verona Rupes, thought to be the tallest cliff in the solar system. The cliff lies on Miranda, one of the planet Uranus's five major moons. The moon is relatively small, with a width of fewer than 300 miles, only one-seventh of the width of Earth's moon. The moon's varied landscape makes it a well-known space object. With giant canyons up to 12 times deeper than that of Earth's Grand Canyon, the moon has many marvels. Miranda is also famous for its strange appearance. Some say it even resembles Frankenstein's monster because of its jumbled look. Adding to the strangeness and beauty of Miranda is this massive cliff. Veronda Rupes was discovered in January of 1986 by a Voyager 2 space probe. Our understanding of the cliff seems to be getting clearer, as scientists previously thought that the cliff was only 3 to 6 miles high, but as of 2016, they now believe it to be about 12 miles high. That height would make it the tallest known cliff in the entire solar system. In comparison, Earth's most towering vertical cliff, Mount Thor, located in northern Canada and named after the Norse god of thunder, is only about one mile high. There are many mysteries that remain in regards to Verona Rupes. Scientists believe that it was possibly formed by a significant impact on the moon or by tectonic surface motion. Due to Miranda's low gravity, a fall from the cliff would take about 12 minutes at a speed of about 124 miles per hour. Thrill seekers everywhere would be happy to know that NASA itself claims that if one were to fall from Verona Rupes, they might very well survive. While no one is expected to fall from Verona Rupes anytime soon, these calculations add to the understanding of how special the cliff truly is. Each new space discovery pushes the boundaries of what we know and inspires us to continue exploring. Even with all that we have learned in recent years, there are still many mysteries waiting to be solved. What will be the next big discovery? No one knows for sure, but that doesn't stop us from guessing and dreaming about all of the possibilities. But what do you make of these interesting discoveries? Be sure to let us know your thoughts in the comment section below and help us by growing this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.